Glory be to God. Can we say hallelujah to the Lord? Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Amen, amen, amen. Hallelujah. We bless the name of the Lord. We want to thank Minister Daphne for ushering us into the presence of the Lord through prayer. Let's just give him a round of a clap for um, Minister Daphne. Amen. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. How many of you are excited to be here today? Amen. And I'm sure you guys came with expectation. You want something from the Lord. Amen. Hallelujah. But you know the wall of Jericho didn't come down where people were watching around. They had to make noise, right? They had to make a sound. There has to be a sound that comes from your belly. You have to speak up. You know, you have to declare what you want into the atmosphere. So we want, we want, we are all alive, right? We are all in our right minds. We have our health by the grace of God. Everyone looks absolutely beautiful and handsome on tonight. So when we come up here, we need you to give us feedback. Amen? It's not only because we want the feedback, but we know the noise, the sound. Sometimes there's a sound in your spirit. If you just hear that sound in your spirit, you can yell it out. God knows why you're making that sound. Amen? Hallelujah. Hallelujah. So don't be silent. Don't be stiff. Don't be shy. Because we're all family in the presence of the Lord. Amen? I came here for something. I mean, I'm under the prophet, but every time I get an opportunity to travel with him, I have an expectation. I'm standing here right now and I have a dire need. But listen, this is an opportunity for God to show up for me. Amen? So when you come into the house of the Lord, you don't just sit there, but you open up your mouth. You open up your heart and you speak. Whatever that is that you want. The Bible says, speak those things as not there. Wait. Speak those things as not in the world. I'm so sorry, people of God. Please excuse me. But, we, we, you know, we want to go ahead and speak out. We don't want to just sit and stare. But without, without further ado, we're going to prepare our hearts. Amen. The Lord loves worship. Amen. The Lord loves praise. They say you can only, the Lord, you can only praise the Lord in spirit and in truth. Okay, people of God. So what you're going to do is prepare your hearts to worship the Lord. Through your worship, you make love to him. Through your love, I mean, through your worship, you show appreciation unto him. Through your love, I mean, through your worship, you give love back unto the Father for who he is and what he is representing in your life. You know how many things we may have escaped that is unbeknownst to us? How many things, how many traps we, we, we skipped over that's unknown to us? That alone should make you excited. So as we prepare our hearts and prepare our vocal cords, <clears throat> I'm not the best singer, but I'm gonna try. We're gonna we're gonna welcome Apostle Stephanie. That's gonna bless us. That's gonna bless us with worship and praise on tonight. So let's give her a round of a clap, people of God. Let's clap our hands and welcome the woman of God. That's gonna usher us into the presence of the Lord in the mighty name of Jesus. God bless you, woman of God, and thank you so much for being here today.